and Valentine Day is coming in a less than one month, so maybe you need something pink. Who knows? Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Yev. Are you bored with a standard, perfect mechanical keyboards, red, blue, yellow, all of this? What about this pinky stuff? I just found this keyboard on Amazon and based on description, uh, it sounds as a high quality keyboard with everything in place. So I decided to give it a shot and you know what, it's uh, something new, it's ProtoArc with Royal X together. So it's a little bit unique design, from other side it's all standard wireless and wired yellow Gatron pre-looped switches like lubricated stabilizers, all of it. So let's check, let's check what is inside, let's connect and check sound test, let's see the Pro driver and RGB and yeah. Let's decide if it makes sense to try this one today because it's already one year on the market. So let's see if it's still valuable purchase for you or not. Let's go. So first of all, let's dive into the box. Okay, let's check what we have inside. So it's a kind of nice packaging, you know, even for the gift, it looks premium. So inside the box we have obviously quick manual, which is explaining how to connect to different operation systems. Like immediately from the side we have additional yellow switches. In the middle of the box we have a keyboard itself. So there we go. This is a keyboard itself. It's a pleasant like light pink and dark pink with this additional metal knob, USB dongle on off and metal plate on the back side. But what else do we have? Detailed manual, so keycap puller, key switch puller and additional legs for the back side. I will show you in a second. Okay, nice. Some custom coiled USB A USB C cable. Super nice. Time to move on. Let's see main parameters of this keyboard. So in general, this is a 65% layout keyboard, so you don't have this F row, but you have additional uh, legends on the side of the almost all keycaps, and you have this function to use like second layer or third layer of functions. It's a obviously very nice, very interesting design with this additional metal plates from a side. Really looks not, you know, not common. So, and uh, it's like a lot of different emblems, Royal X, Never Stop Fighting, Proto Arc, you have Slain, an enemy, and other stuff, which is, if you like this, it looks good. So, from the back side, you have this Rubet legs, but also you can change them for, the, for this extended legs, right? And they're magnet. So, basically, you have two options. One, which is installed by default, and second, which is a little bit higher elevation. So let's use higher elevation, yep, and there you go. So in general, you can connect this keyboard via Bluetooth or 2.4 wireless dongle, and uh, it's a good for gaming, uh, NK rollover and all other stuff, but you, ha you can check this in the description of this keyboard if you're interested in it. Let me show you some real stuff instead. Let's start from the keycaps, key so they are double shot, they are double shot PBT, so it's a kind of high quality uh, keycaps uh, and it's obvious for the premium quality keyboard, so they are well, well made. Let's quickly check Gatron Yellow, so this is a 3 pin mechanical switch from Gatron, linear one, and it's uh, pre-looped during manufacturing. I can see that it's a north facing LED and we don't have any padding under the switch or and I cannot see any foam around. Interesting design. It's kind of heavy one, it's almost 1 kg, so some substantial weight in it, which is pleasant if you are not going to travel with it. Okay, let's connect this to my MacBook and do the sound test. But
Everything sounds good except this space. But in general, sound is pleasant. So let's connect this keyboard to the MacBook first and see how it works. I will use uh, this coiled cable and we need to switch this meta like metal knob to the wired mode, this one. And switch on, okay, there we go. So you can connect this to the iOS, Mac and Win. Currently I connected to the Mac and we will check Pro Driver and PC version a little bit later. In general, all good. So it's connected and up and running. Cool. What about connecting to the Windows PC and checking the Pro Driver? Let's connect this keyboard to my PC via USB dongle. It will be more clear picture on the table because this coiled cable, you know, looks a little bit strange. You can, you can order much better coiled cables. So I've inserted 2.4 dongle into my USB extension. Now I switch to the 2.4 on the keyboard itself and switch to the Win mode. And there we go. Together with the Pro Driver, let's test RGB. Okay, so let's install the driver. You see this Royal X Y68. And now we can do some configuration. Interesting what we can do. We can change key sensitivity. It's interesting. We can change different layers of functions. I have mentioned this at the beginning of the review. Lighting. Interesting enough that we can do this configuration without wired connection. So it's all wireless. It's interesting. Also, you can do some macros. I'm not fan of it, so but you can do it. It's for gaming. And obviously some support, you can update application version or firmware, firmware, right? So, a lot. And you can even change some keys, macro, media, disable. So, a, a lot of different options. Unfortunately, I cannot see option to set it up key by key, different colors for different keys. So, I think it's not available. Okay, now let's check the RGB. Let me switch off my lights. So to change, you can switch on and switch off this RGB, right? But also you can change different schemas. You can decrease or increase brightness. This one is interesting. So brightness is uh, like, you know, enough for this keyboard. You can see from different angles. Key ca keycaps is obviously not shine through, so it's a little bit hard to see the legends because they're kind of pink. But in general, you can see that it looks good. Okay, guys, as a summary, I think it's a great, unique keyboard, especially, you know, St. Valentine Day is coming in a less than one month, so maybe you need something pink. Who knows? Thank you for being with me. See you next time. Bye-bye.